is in Per Nikolai. Um, currently we've made quite significant progress with the split, 51%. Before we are negative four with them, which will still be enemies with them. Well, mostly enemies, but there will be significant progress towards the um, CPU part. Split energy transporter. Now, this sector has been a pretty decent way. Um, we has been doing its job really well on helping us get to that rank. But apparently, as you keep destroying these um, boron ships, the boron will not really take it. Well, indefinitely, they will. They will send um, their guppy after you after after for so long. And our guppy is a frigate class, which is kind of deadly t against your uh, P, even though it is rather weakly equipped. Also, we are getting r really close to negative, I mean, not negative, but um, plus six with the Xenon, which will allow us to get ourselves the better um, Corvette, as well as maybe even the Q. Not really sure, but yeah. Anyway, we're going to cut off and now over, and, but when we get back, we'll be probably getting really close to um, raising our rank with the split. And we're back. And right now we are really close to, um, we're getting pretty close to negative four. Now, you may be wondering, what in the hell am I flying? Well, this is the PX, and this is, and yeah, it looks pretty ugly um, in the cockpit view, but this is the ship that's better than the P, it seems. Now, I'm actually quite aware that there are um, cockpit, cockpit mods to, well, fix this um, horrific problem that is... Um, well, this, I mean, look at this, this barely even flips with the camera. But, I'll think about it. Now, um, now this, um, ship is pretty much, um, better in almost every way with the, than the P. However, there is one slight problem it has, is that it, it can only carry four, um, turrets on its main turret slot. While the while there are um, four more while it does carry more um, turrets in general than the P, I mean it can only carry four uh, main turrets on the I mean yeah four main um, turrets. However it does have four more on the front which um, but however you have to control them with the autopilot. Command console. Anyway, um, we are still hunting down. Octopus. We're still hunting down Boron, um, and the split have really not been making this easy on me, and they haven't constantly been sending bombers after me, which I've been dealing with. Because, because this, well, you see, enemies don't really like you to to overstay your welcome at these sectors. Split passenger shuttle Boron Octopus. And eventually they may send rapid response vessels after you. I had to take down two split bombers because of such. And now since we're at already and since we're at like negative five with them, uh, destroying those uh, ships aren't really gonna do much Split to employee them. shuttle service aren't really going to do much to our um, notoriety, if anything at all. Well, again, we are getting quite close to... Baron Octopus. Plus five, I mean plus four, I mean negative four. It looks like something jumped in or jumped out. Baron Barracuda. Hmm. These are easy pickings. Now, again, um, the more threatening the ship you destroy, the the more notoriety you Baron get. Octopus. And right, and this right here Target is really is good points we can get. 
And also, we are equipped with Iron Shard Railguns, which is much more powerful than the um, high energy plasma throwers. Anyway, we're gonna. We're actually going to have the stated command accepted. Barracuda. You ain't going anywhere. Now this thing's a little bit awkward to fly because of this because of the shape of the cockpit, but it shouldn't be too much of a trouble. Especially with that. And this, sh and this ship also holds more shielding than the P as well. Argon Energy Transporter Gate. All right. So what? How far are we right now? We are getting a little bit closer. Argon Energy Transporter. Gate, Ocean of Fantasy. Well, it looks like the Boron kind of had enough of me and actually decided to send a small little fleet of ships after me. Well, maybe they're not after me, they're just patrolling the sector. But they are accompanied by a Hydra, which is a Corvette class vessel. Let's see its shielding. And it's pitiful. We can probably take it. And looks like they are, are attacking me. No way. System family right. And we just gained notoriety with the split. It seems. Yeah, we are now um, negative four in me of rank car. Oh, wrong car. At twenty percent. And we jumped out of there just in time before our shields went down. We're just gonna wait for them to get over here and finish them off. And they're probably gonna be coming after me still. Baron Octopus. Fantasy. Oh, what's behind me? Um, let's see, I don't want to select them because my troop might. Looks like the split are still sending their military after me. I don't want to set this Barracuda. split. Missile. Hmm. Ah. For the queen. Oh, me. 
to the north gate. Jump device charging at 10%. Entering system, family right. Boron Barracuda, Boron Pike. Banshee missile asteroid. We are now twenty eight percent with the split. It looks like we just need one more kill to go to Bar rank eighteen. Barracuda. Fight rank eighteen. How far is he? Eight. Split military Boron Barracuda. Ba Banshee missile installed. Uh, he's too far. I ain't gonna bother. Um, I'm just gonna jump out. And we're back. And we're gonna go over and end this video off by showing a nice little, um, well, not a little, but a huge Xenon invasion in a sector. Right now I'm having a little bit of trouble trying to get a little bit of split rank because the raptor is psychically coming after my ship. But yeah, this is pretty much what a xenon invasion is in this. They, what they do is they try to invade random sectors. I don't know if they're going to be actually invading this one. Or if they're just going to pick a different sector to invade, but anyway. Um, what they do, what the Xeon does is that they invade a sector and they try to destroy all the, well, pretty much do what an invasion will do, typically destroy all the structures. And once they are finished, they will plant their um, Xenon station in the middle of their sector and claim the sector as their own. And yeah, the sector will revert to um, Xenon ownership. However, this is Split Mamba. This is actually kind of difficult, especially in Albion Prelude, for them to do this because Albion Prelude adds a mechanic known as rapid response vessels, which is the well, the race that's defending the sector will actually generate a pretty powerful capital fleet or whatever that will try to take out any invaders. Like, for example, if you, like, overstay your welcome in a... Ooh, overstay your welcome in a sector. Like, here's one, for example. Split rapid response viper. Now, that right there is a bomber. And I'm pretty sure that's going to start spewing out miss torpedoes at one of these ships. Ooh. Xenon K. Man, some, it, that got hit hard by something. But yeah, this is um, the, a Xenon invasion going on. And when we return, Teladi energy transporter. we'll try to see if we can improve our split rank a little bit more. Right now we're, we still got a little bit of ways to go. We're at 34%. But tune in next time as we do so. See you then.